The metrics show MongoDB's activity in real time, how often data is read, written, and connected. Every database vendor now claims to be AI ready and MongoDB is no exception. Most of you already know MongoDB as a flexible document database, but the company now presents it as a unified data platform built for AI and real-time applications. Today we're going to look at what that actually means and whether MongoDB lives up to the pitch. So what makes MongoDB AI ready? MongoDB now markets itself as a unified unified data platform for modern AI and real-time apps, meaning vector search, flexible document storage for embeddings, fast ingestion, and the ability to keep operational and retrieval data in one place. They also say it's simple, scalable, and built for the type of unstructured and semi-structured data AI runs on. And we're going to put that to the test. MongoDB is known for its schema flexibility instead of Storing data in fixed tables like SQL databases, MongoDB uses JSON-like documents that can evolve as your application evolves. For AI workloads, that flexibility matters. Embeddings, metadata, and multi-model data don't always fit neatly into rigid tables, and they tend to change as your models change. MongoDB lets you store these structures naturally without redesigning a schema every time. So let's test MongoDB. Let's see how much of a unified data platform it really is. Let's dive deep. I'm going to sign up on MongoDB. The sign up process is straightforward. When you create a MongoDB Atlas cluster, Atlas provisions and manages the database for you, but it runs on top of your chosen cloud provider, AWS, Azure, or Google Cloud. So while MongoDB manages the database layer, the underlying infrastructure comes from these hyperscale clouds. Let's choose AWS for this demo create deployment create database user let's click on choose a connection method let's pick drivers i'm picking drivers because it gives me the connection string that my app will need i'm planning to use tray solo to build the app and i should be able to directly connect it to my mongodb database this will allow the app to store retrieve and update real data i have my connection string that's enough for me to start building an app with tray i am on tray solo and I am going to ask Trey to build an app for me. This is my prompt, build a personal journal bot that lets users write daily entries, store them with AI reflections and sentiment analysis. I am also sharing the MongoDB connection string, send, the agent starts working, generating the documentation for this journal bot. The entire process is straightforward. And for this kind of application, MongoDB fits well because each journal entry can have different fields, text, mood, AI reflections, tags, and MongoDB's flexible document model stores all of that without fixed schemas. MongoDB also supports real-time updates, vector search, for semantic pattern detection and fast querying across large sets of personal entries. So this works naturally for tracking evolving and unstructured journal data. The agent is creating MongoDB connections and database models. Again, the entire process seems simple and direct. With modern AI coding tools, you don't need to be overly technical to create an app and connect it to the MongoDB. The app is ready. I am clicking deploy and the app is being deployed. The app is running and I'm creating a new entry. Let's call it reviewing MongoDB. That will be my journal event in the thoughts section. All right, today I'm testing MongoDB. Let's see how this works. 
save entry. Let's add another journal entry just so we have two to take a look at. Another entry titled MongoDB. As you can see, we now have two recent entries. Let's go back to MongoDB and look for them. I'm on MongoDB, I'm clicking on clusters and here I can see my data. I'll click on view monitoring. Here you can see connections, network, op counters and other metrics. In collections, I can see the actual journal entries, the users and the analysis. What's cool is that everything, users, entries, even the AI reflections lives together in one place, each with its own shape. You don't have to force data into rigid tables like in SQL, MongoDB stores it as it is. That's why it feels natural for apps that evolve over time, like this journal bot that mixes text, moods, and AI insights. The metrics show MongoDB's activity in real time, how often data is read, written, and connected, giving you a live view of your app's performance, and you can upgrade your plan to enhance it further. The plans are on the screen. Anyway, I'm ready for my verdict. The AI space is moving fast and MongoDB has clearly adapted. It's evolving into a unified data platform that supports flexible, unstructured and semi-structured data. The kind of data AI models use every day. The platform also includes vector search, real-time analytics and the scalability needed for large data sets. That makes it a practical option for storing embeddings or powering intelligent applications. In short, MongoDB has grown beyond the simple document database. It now includes features like vector search analytics and real-time data handling that make it a solid choice for building AI-driven applications. And if you want to experiment with it yourself, Atlas has a free tier you can use to try everything you've seen today. I want to thank MongoDB for sponsoring this video and for evolving its platform, which is now capable of bringing classic database concepts with the future of intelligent systems. I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave your comments in the comment section. I'm done for now and I'll talk to you soon. Ivan Kiwi. Oh.